Hey guys, if you don't follow smaller brands for gaming mouse pads, you probably haven't heard of this one yet. This is the Esports Tiger Neon Pad. Now I'm gonna try and make this review as short and concise as possible, so I just want to let you know that only a small percent of you watching my videos are actually subscribed, and I'd really appreciate it if you could drop a sub, as it really helps out in making these videos high quality for you. One more quick thing, Addis Inc. sent this mousepad out to me so I could review it, and I just want to let you know that that does not affect my review in any way, but if you do want to support the channel, and you want to buy this mousepad, use the link in the description to help support me. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, so on the product page for this mousepad, we can see that it is meant for speed and control according to Esports Tiger which basically makes this a hybrid pad between the two. It's available in three different sizes, however the one I have is in large, and that is $35. If you wanted an extra large, it would be $50, and medium, which I would not recommend since I think it is too small, is $24 USD. Esports Tiger also claims that the pad maintains its quality after washing, and while I have not tested that, I'm just taking their word for it and letting you know. So, this wouldn't be a mousepad review without the glide test, so let's get into that. And then after that, I want to go over some opinions that I had about this mousepad. So now that all the sound tests are done, I wanted to go over my personal opinions with this mousepad. And let me just say that I really, really like using it. The texture, as you can see right now, is really good, and it feels really comfortable to use. In fact, I might go as far as to say as it's probably one of the most comfortable pads that I've used, with the least comfortable being some as such as the mousepad company. Now, one thing that I did not like about this mousepad was that the stitched edges started fraying really fast because I was using it so much. And maybe that might not be an issue for you, but it just ruins the overall look of the pad for me, especially on the bottom side. Of course, that's not that big of a deal, but it might be to some of you. Another thing is that this pad isn't the fastest out there. Now, of course, this isn't a bad thing at all. Mouse pads are supposed to be personal preference depending on whether you want a speed pad or a control pad. And the Esports Tiger Neon Pad is basically a hybrid between the two for people that want both. I hope you enjoyed this review. I know it's pretty short, but I wanted to make it as fast as possible so you can see if you want this pad or not. Once again, a huge shout out to Addis Inc for sending this out so I could review it. And please go check out their site using my link in the description below, and especially if you want to buy this mousepad, use my link, help support the channel, and help support Addisync. Again, thank you so much for watching, drop a like and maybe sub if you enjoyed, and let me know your thoughts on this video in the comments below, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye!